Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Mings, and I welcome you guys back to Let's Play Fire Emblem, the heroes we deserve. Uh, it's time for chapter four. School's out, apparently. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Breaking news, this just in. Fan favorite best boy Roy was assaulted today by an unknown assailant. Over to another goddamn Anna in the field. <laughs> Thanks Anna, I'm another goddamn Anna. And I'm here with Mr. Roy, who's been assaulted by an unknown individual. <laughs> we tried asking the locals, but it appears the only red house has already been visited. <laughs> Mr. Roy, do you have anything to say? Riveting! <laughs> Back to you, other goddamn Anna. Oh my god, the storytelling of this hack never ceases to amaze me. Thanks, other goddamn Anna. This unknown assailant is believed to have a bladed weapon of some sort. So be on the lookout for anyone matching that description. In other news, should you use Amelia? The answer will shock you. More on that tonight at 8. <laughs> Yo, Smokey, you hear the news? Some jerks messed up Roy. Dude, no need to kill my buzz. Let's just chill out, have a good time. I already ordered up some a pizza. You cool with Hawaiian? Fucking A, dude. Extra pineapple. <laughs> Bunch of dudes coming out from the road. Think it's them? Nah, bro. No worries. Let's just have a good time, my dude. Pass the blunts. No prob. Thanks. <laughs> Fucking Josh ran in circles. We should check out the school. Bad guys always attack children. That's probably the best idea you've ever come up with. Ever. Of all time. Hey, kid. Hi, mister. How did you know my name is Kid? <laughs> what? Anyways, there's bad guys roaming around. We're here to protect you and all the other children in the school. Think we'll get paid? It's just me, nobody. Oh, yeah, buddy. We're gonna be rich. <laughs> hey, creeper. Leave those kids alone. <laughs> what? We're protecting the children from bad guys. Why would you say... Aha! Nice try, Mr. Bad Guy. Let's fuck up this team. They're getting pretty clever. <laughs> oh my god, this, this hack is amazing. Oh my god. Alright. We have Smokey the Boss, a foolish mage who likes to have a good time. I think this is an Astor um, splice. And he has Renewal, Pragmatic, and Chivalry. Okay. Oh my god, okay, and there's a kid here, apparently, who's named Kid. Some random kid. Okay. That's pretty cool. Okay, so again, we get to control these guys, and we can take whatever we want. Uh, Jagger is level 13. You know what? I'm, I, I said I was gonna early promote all my dudes, and that's exactly what I'm gonna do. Because I think that's fun. And he becomes the Swordmaster. They even got the new Swordmaster model, so that's kind of nice. There you go. Ooh, nice. Defense boosts. There we go. Do I want to promote anyone else? Uh, Bianca, sure. I think I have more Master Seals, don't I? Yeah, I do. Let's, uh... Maybe we should save some promotions for the second group. I want to promote Bianca, though. I don't see what she promote promotes into. So she becomes a... A Valkyrie, it would appear. Yeah, a Valkyrie. Sweets. That's nice. Always nice to get mounts. And I think I'll, I'll save the last Master Seal for the middle group. I think. I mean, they got Christy, which is pretty good. And Stevie. Yeah, Stevie's sitting on this one, actually. Um, it would be nice to get one more promotion, though. I wonder if Chester promotes. I want to see if he actually promotes. Oh, wow. Does he? Oh, uh, no, he doesn't. How about Josh? Can he promote? Uh, he's level 9, so not yet. Dominic is level 12. Hey, let's let's get an early game Berserker. Fuck yeah, let's get an early game Berserker. I'm down for that. Let's go. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, I wonder if they use the updated Berserker animations. They probably do. Oh, that is some that is some sexy stance right there. Okay, I think we're done promoting for now. So, uh, we have a hammer, we have a nerd slayer. I'm going to take the rapier back from the other group. I don't know who should get the underwear. 
Uh, maybe I should just give it to Bianca for memes, but I'll give her the barrier stat for sure. And the rescue. There's no point in not having that, am I right? So I don't need to have two Bud Lights. That's fine. Okay, who should get the underwear? So, let's see. Chester... I don't think anyone from this group particularly needs it. Nah, I think I'll save it. It's for luck. It's good, but it's not necessary, I think. Alright, I think I'm good. I'm just gonna check one last time that there's no... I'm gonna give a Josh on Axe Reaver just in case. Alright, I'm pretty happy with this. Oh, I forgot to check the internet. Although I don't have any money. Oh, we can actually buy Lance Reavers and Axe Reavers. Huh. You know what? What I could do. Ooh, Hail Mary. What's that? Thieves only. Long range throwing knife. Ooh, that's kind of sexy. Hmm. I could. I could take out the underwear. I could sell the underwear. I could sell some Bud Light too. I feel like I have a lot of them. Although, hmm. Budweiser maybe? I could sell the gin. Let's see how much the uh, the underwear sells for on the internet. There you go. Selling underwear on the internet. So, am I like a Patreon girl now? <laughs> so yeah, let's uh, get ourselves a... Um, what do we want? I do want the Hail Mary later on. It seems pretty fun. I guess I, I should just buy it, even though, none, even though I can't necessarily use it right now. And I guess a Sword Reaver for my Berserker would be good, and I have no money. But yeah, that, that, that knife sounds like a, a ton of fun. So we can put the, uh, we can put this here. And then we can give the Sword Reaver to Dominic. Okay, I'm pretty happy about that. I think 4,000 gold is a lot more important than 4 luck. Hmm, looks like the school's door is locked. If only we had a key. I had a key back at my place. That's not how keys work. Pretty sure that's how they work. <laughs> ah, he's so fucking wasted. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> what is that? <laughs> I have eaten almost all the bagels. Nom 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 nom. Almost finished. Only one left. Oh boy, we gotta visit that house now. I think. Um, can we? Is there? Oh shit! Right. We actually had a key in the convoy that we could have taken out, but. Uh, Chester's- I don't think Chester's the convoy. No, he's not. But, uh, I, I assume that, like, one will drop, hopefully? Also, I don't have a hand axe on my Berserker. That makes me kind of sad. Also, we should defend the- I love how it has a question mark next to it. Defend kid? Like, the game is not really sure if that's what we're here to do. That's actually really hilarious. I, I, I suppose we have to protect the kid? I mean, ow, that really hurts, though. Um... Yeah, these guys could have been positioned better, but I guess I'm stuck with it now. Um, yeah, I guess I'll go over here and then I'll... Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm good at this game, apparently. I mean, they're the good guys. They wouldn't attack a kid, right? Surely they wouldn't attack a kid. I also like how he doesn't get the little... That bards normally get. Uh, okay. Not a big fan of this 2% crit rate, but I guess I'll make do. Most important thing is I'm able to counter. I mean, I, I guess we'll see if he goes for the kid or not. I mean, they're, they're the good guys, so it would sort of make sense if they didn't go for Actually, nah, I'm not gonna take any chances. I'm just gonna barrier up the kid, I guess. That, that's what I do. Yep, I barrier up kids. That's what I like doing. See? Now the kid is protected with 8 resistance. Even has a base rest of 1. What a good kid. Okay, so we got the rapier, which is nice. That should allow us to just murder this guy, or murder kill this guy. Oh, they even gave the armor knight a little quiver. How nice. I like it. And yeah, as always, look at the experience I'm getting, even though I'm promoting. This this hack is designed around early promoting your units, for sure. The amount of experience you get per unit is ludicrous. And this also allows me to get the skills faster, which, you know, should make this a hell of a lot easier. I guess Mecha would like this hack. Alright, that should be a ding. And it looks like we also get, like, the special skills at level 2. Uh, normally, you have to wait until level 5 to get the first skill, so that's Astra already. So that's even better. Holy shit. That's ridiculous. Jagger's insane now. Of course, Astra annoys me more often than not, because in this case, it just cost me three extra uses of the rapier. 
So, Astra kind of has a downside. You don't really want to be using low might expensive weaponry on your Swordmaster, because this happens. So, yeah, rip rapier, I guess. Oh, wow, she attacks using her staff. I really like that. That's amazing. I love it. I actually have never seen these uh, updated Valkyrie animations before. That is so cool. Oh, I just gave the monk the goddamn forest, though. I didn't think about that. Didn't even 69. So yeah, I, I sure hope I get another door key, because I had a door key in my convoy. Oh, what's going on here? Whoa, Smokey, a shooting star. Make a wish, my dude. I wish the pizza guy would get here already. <laughs> I got mad munchies. Jenna! Oh no, it's a maris it's a marissery color. Hold up, how did you teleport? Don't worry about it. Anyway, think you can help us fuck up these bad guys? Okay, whatever. Right on! Chester scores the Dark Mage. This was a mistake. I regret this already. Oh no. It's a, it's a Wow, I like how she looks like Null on the minimap, but if you do this, she becomes Jenna. What is it with people and fucking Marissas? I, I don't know why, we have like eight of them in the PME, it's ridiculous. Practices terrible in evil magics, so really likes cats and dogs. Okay, she has seal, seal attack, that's actually kind of cool, so she can like weaken enemies. And life taker, that's also kind of cool. 60 power, 55 skill, 35 speed, 35 luck, 50 defense, 15 resistance, 50 HP. A classic dark mage right here, tons of magic, pretty tanky, slow as fuck. Um, has obliterates. Ooh, that's a brave tome. It has only 12 uses though, so it will get eaten up really fast. And flux. Oh, she comes with her own master seal. What? Let's see you guys, we just like instantly promote her. Oh wait, has she got- yeah, she's gotten her level 10 skill. Let's fucking do it. Let's just instantly promote. Why not? She comes with her own master seal. The game is practically telling us to do it. Aw, she doesn't become the female druid. She actually becomes the male druid. That's kind of sad. Hey, look at that. Three speed. One con. Effectively getting four speed from a promotion, just like Kanastas. That's kind of cool. Okay, I say we send... Uh, hmm. Uh, I say we send Bianca this way. Oh wow, she does fuck all against this guy. I I guess the the best decision here would be oh no, definitely not. We gotta heal this guy up before we do it. Oh, she can reposition. I didn't even think about that. Not that I, I should probably. I, I don't know. Having reposition on your healer seems kind of redundant because in, more often than not, you want to heal with your healers. You don't want to reposition guys. I mean, it's a nice skill to have. I guess you could make some use of it, but for the most part, I. I can't really see myself using it. Anyway, I'm gonna try to use the axe. The axe reaver has just about never mind. Um, so here's the question. Do I want to dance for Josh and try to hit again? I will get charisma if I do. Um, that's plus 10% bonus to hit, which should put my hit rate up to like, what, 73? Or something? Yeah. I'm gonna try to bank on this one. If I miss this one, then nah, never mind. Okay, good. There we go. Good job, Josh. So he's level 10 now, which means he'll get a skill. I'm guessing he gets like elbow room or wait, is that rightful king? Wait, what? Rightful king? No, savior. Never mind. It has this very similar icon. Oh, uh, shit. Oh, crap. They're gonna take the kid now. I need to. Hmm. Yeah, this is not good, because what's going to happen now, I think... Wait a minute, I barriered that kid, which means I think it actually survives. Wait, zero speed, is going to get doubled. Yeah, it's going to get doubled. So, the, the kid has seven rests, which will actually reduce the da Actually, the kid fucking survives. Okay, I guess I'll find out if they go for the kid or not now. Yeah. Yeah, that's actually kind of funny. All right, let's let's see let's see if it actually works. Let's use the axe here. Oh wow, though I've never seen those before. I actually prefer those animations to the regular berserker ones where they just drop the head the axe on them. Um. All right. Well, I can't retaliate against this guy. This mage looks like it might move, so I'm just gonna do this and see if the mage attacks me. Oh, hi. Oh, I should have swapped my weapon around. That was dumb. But yeah, if if the mage actually goes for the kid, 
the kid will survive. I guess we'll find out. Yep, okay. That's hilarious. I... <laughs> because I barriered the kid as a joke, I actually survived, which is fucking hilarious. Okay. I wonder why Jonah uses the male druid animations. Maybe she has a dick? I don't know. She can also heal now, which is nice. I should probably work on her staff rank. So, but she, I only have one heal staff on me, though. I didn't know I'd get another heal in this chapter. Huh. Oh, oh, light, life taker. That always freaks me out, that animation. Um, okay, so I guess we can use... I think the Axe is effective against armor. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Axe it's so funny. I love it. Oh, I want to see the crit, though. How does the crit look? I'm like, I love the animations of this hack. They're so good. We got so much juicy snacks at E3. Thank God for these amazing hackers who keep inventing and making new amazing things for people to use in their hacks. Oh yeah, there you go. There you get the door key. Okay, so I don't want to send this to Convoy, obviously. I'll send the Steel Axe to Convoy. What did I get? That is Frenzy. Okay, for every four damage taken plus one to damage dealt. It's a... It's an alright skill, I guess. It's very situational. You usually don't want to be moving around. Oh, cool. We got a support here. Hey, how's it going, Jenna? Uh, you like bingo? No. Ugh, making friends is fucking hard. <laughs> oh, I especially love how you're able to do stuff after you support. It really is nice that you don't have to waste an action on that. Anyway, I should probably swap to a lance or something. 4, 8, 12. If I... Ah, goddammit. I'm just gonna drink a bud. Like, I know the chances of getting crit are small, but just in case it happens, I don't wanna... F I don't wanna be fucked. Here we go. Chester levels up again. He only needs to dance, like, five times to level up, which is really nice. And he's guaranteed to cap his speed on luck, which is also nice. Just too bad that he doesn't get any defense. That does suck a little bit. Here we go. That guy should be dealt with pretty soon. I don't think Jagger can take on the boss, though. I think we might want to send someone else. I mean, he can. I feel like there's probably some secrets here that I'm missing out on. So, we have this guy with a steel sword. This guy with a fire. I mean, it, it wouldn't surprise me if both of these guys move. So, Jagger just won't be able to take that, I think. Unless... Mm, no, I don't really want to deal with that shit. I'm, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. He can't, like, I don't have a light brand or anything like that to deal with those guys from a distance, so. And he will for sure die if he takes boss damage, mage damage, and an armor knight at once, so I'll just wait for the rest of my party to catch up. I need to go open that door anyway. Strength, speed, luck, defense, resistance. That is a delicious level, Josh. Delicious level. So from, oh. Yeah, again, if there's one thing you can count on this hack doing, it's sending a lot of reinforcements your way, which I'm not necessarily, like, I don't have a problem with that per se. Reinforcements can be used to make a map more fun. I think actually, like, not to toot my own horn, but I think the FE8 PME does reinforcements pretty well. That's mostly to Shusuka's credit, though, because he, he designed all the maps, but he has a really good way of, like, sending in these waves that really, like, complicates the maps. Uh, anyway, I'm gonna here have a key. See what's behind this door. Oh shit! I should have known there could be fucking enemies here. Oh, that's terrible. Okay, so I think what we'll do then. So, Pete, tell your mom I said hi. That's that's a dick move. <laughs> nice, nice. I love this skill. Intimidate and natural cover. Shiruvarans seems kind of odd. Yeah, six to nine hit. Nice, nice meme there. I see what you're doing. And he has a bagel. Super rare apparently replaces medicines. That's plus 5% bonus to growth rates. But I see what I can do here. I'll just dance for Dominic and send him in. He's a berserker, so he should be able to handle this. Uh, what about this enemy? Steel lance and a chest key. Okay. I mean, this doesn't seem so hard. Uh, we don't want a sword reaver. I mean, it... So this guy does 10 damage. What does this guy do? 21 damage. Oh, I'm able to survive that, no problem at all. I can use the axe here. That should be effective against the boss even. Oh, that's a crit. Oh, that is amazing. I do sort of miss them tossing their axe up in the air a little bit, but... Oh, shit. No, wait. That guy... Please don't tell me that guy has a ranged attack or else the kid is dead. I don't think so. It looks like the lands didn't attack at range. 
Okay, now he doesn't move. Oh, more reinforcements. This seems like a job for Jenna. Oh, wow. Okay. I'm just gonna murder you now. Pretty sure Jenna can deal with whatever magic users get shown my way, even at a weapon triangle disadvantage. So I'm not particularly worried. So let's just use the axe here to kill this guy. Oh, that's a crit. Oh, of course it's a crit. It's a boss. Okay, well, we dealt with the mini boss. Thank God. I assume they're just there to scare the shit out of you because they're right next to the kid. So if you open up the door, there's a chance, like, the kid might fuck you over. <sighs> I'll send this to the other group. Feeling a bit charitable today, you know? Um, anyway, I'm gonna send Chester down here, I think. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna heal up Jagger first just so he's at full health. Could have barred him, I guess, but I feel like this works just as well. And then I'm gonna play for Bianca. And have her do a little bit of fighting. Maybe I'll paralyze the Cavalier. Oh, alright, I can do that. Ah, uh, maybe I'll keep Chester a little bit further in the back. Doesn't seem like a terrible idea. But yeah, there's a lot of enemies here, so if I make sure I... If I, like, paralyze the Cavalier, then I don't have to deal with him anymore. Granted, I actually hit. Wait, does this thing have three range? I think it might have three range. So it was silly of me to attack from two range. But okay, I don't have to deal with that Cav. Speed and luck. Oh, what's that? That's a spell. I guess I can stay within Chester's Charisma range. That would kind of help me out a little bit. Amaterasu. Okay, that's an AoE heal. I like that. We could even, like, chug a javelin and then ride back. I think I'm fine with this. God, I love Super Kanto so much. It's completely broken, but man, it is so much fun to play around with. I mean, it does sort of make mounted units OP as fuck, but I don't honestly care. Oh, cool. He can still heal. Oh, right. It's like an... I think one of those guys have Amaterasu. Maybe the monk has it or something. Oof. Oh, why did I not swap my tome? That was dumb. I should have swapped my tome. It's not gonna break, but still, this was stupid. Why didn't I trade my tome away? Hopefully the monk goes for the... for Josh. Okay. We're at a weapon triangle disadvantage here, and we're fighting in the forest, so... It's actually going to be a little bit hard to hit this guy. Not something you see every day. <laughs> but this is fine. We're going to murder the ma- Oh, no. The, ma the monk went for Bianca. That actually kind of sucks. I mean, at least we petrify all of them, but I didn't want to waste my, my, my shining bind this way. But hey, at least they're very easy to kill now. Alright, this should be a dead uh, mage. Again, it's so nice to get that 4 attack speed promo from early promoting. Really makes your dark magic user so much better. This is why Mecha Advocates early promoting Kanas. Alright, yay. <laughs> skill. Oh, that's the skill. What is that? And what I love is she just... No, actually, no. She doesn't heal unless she initiates the attack. That's how it works. Um... Im oh, what?! That is ridiculous. That is absolutely crazy. Okay, I don't... Okay, if I do this, then there's a chance the Vigilante might swoop around and target the child, and I don't want that, so I'm just gonna do this instead. Um, no, I guess I don't need to use my Wham Shear. Let's save it a little bit. There's a chance we might crit here, or maybe proc an Astra. I mean, when you have Astra, it's perfectly nice to, like, use Steels. I think Steel Search are good because they have enough might to where Astra might do something, and they're not expensive to the point where Astra is going to, like, break them. Strength, Skill, and Speed. Wow, Jagger has 20 fucking speed now. He's so fucking fast. And, yeah, since we get, like... I mean, these guys will pretty much just kill themselves. They're really, like... I can take my time here. They're paralyzed for five turns. That's... That's ridiculous. Um... Let's just do this, I guess. It looks like every attack is a crit, which is a little bit annoying. Because, like, the staff shines, which is what it does when... or on bishops when they attack. Uh... I, I guess we'll just do this. Just let Jagger kill that guy. And then we can take on the boss, I think. 
There we go. Should be an easy kill. So yeah, you get the, uh, I think how it works, I'm not sure if it sets their critical avoid to zero? I think it just sets their, their avoid to zero, and then it sets their, um... Then it sets their, like, how does it work? Like, it gives you, it gives you 30 flat crit, I know that, but I'm not sure if it also sets your crit avoid to zero or not. I don't think it does? I'm not sure. Anyway, impale on a freaking dark mage? That is OP as shit! I mean, the reason why Impale is so broken uh, in the in this patch is that, like, normally in uh, Radiant Dawn, I mean, all third tier skills kill anyway, and I think it has, like, half your percentage skill chance to proc. Anyway, I'm actually actually gonna kill this guy with Jenna to get some healing out of it. So, in Radiant Dawn, Impale is sort of like a lackluster third tier skill, because almost every other skill in the game, Luna, Soul, Aether, Astra, it's basically like an instant kill. But in this patch, skills don't work like that, also that was a support. And also, what is even more insane about Impale is that it's just flat skill activation. The enemy can't reduce it with luck or anything like that, so that is literally a 11% chance to just insta-kill most things you attack, which is absolutely broken for a skill. I mean, you compare this with the Berserker skill, which just grants you a little bit of extra damage passively whenever you're taking damage. It's not nearly as good. I mean, Astra's also a little bit shit in this hack, not only because it takes a ton of time to proc, but it's like, yeah, skill percentage chance activation to, like, get five attacks, which doesn't guarantee you a kill, per se. And against a really tough opponent, it might just do, like, five attacks at, like, one damage and just break your weapon. Um, I mean, Amaterasu, that's more of a support skill, but yeah, like, Impale is absolutely broken, and I feel like whoever designed it in this format should probably, like, make it half-skill proc at the very least. Because, as it is right now, it is just just so much better. It's one of the reasons why the why Halberdiers are so OP in the PME. Same thing with Colossus. When Colossus procs, it just triples your strength and has a skill percentage chance to proc. So it's basically, like, skill percentage chance to insta-kill your opponent, because most warriors have, like, 20 plus strength, which equates to, like, 60 plus damage, which is just ridiculous. Anyway, um, I'm going to barrier up Josh, and I'm gonna see if I can't just ride into the forest and pull those guys. Again, it looks like the mage is stationary, but the, but the boss might not be, so... I don't want to take any chances. So if I just do this, and just go and play for Josh... Then I should be able to run him into the forest. I think? No, but I can do this. Uh, but then again, I don't... Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna play it safe. Okay, they're not moving. That's good. So I'll just do this. Oh wow, that's not even a kill. Let's get Jagger in here. Let's give him a barrier up as well. If nothing else, then to give Bianca some exper extra experience. Gotta look out for our blondish tar after all, am I right? Anyway, this was a fun map. This was so much fun. Uh, this hack is really growing on me in a big way, like, it's quickly becoming one of my favorite hacks. I'm not gonna start circle jerking it like I did Staff of Ages, because that's- I feel like that does the hack more harm than it is good. I don't think any- anyone from the Staff of Ages team actually wanted to admit it, but I think they actually ended up being a bit- Oh wait, did I just dance for Bianca? I didn't mean to do that. Uh, anyway, I think, like, I don't think they necessarily wanted to admit it, but I think they sort of didn't like the fact that I circle jerked or hacked too much, because it brought them a lot of negative publicity. Because Staff of Ages quickly turned into the, oh, it's that hack that Manx loves for some reason, and it sort of became their identity, and I think they didn't like that a lot. Like, none of them admitted it to me, and I think most of the people from the Staff of Ages team really like me, and I, I don't think there's any malice there, but I think secretly they did not like the whole Manx Circle Jerk meme, because it sort of became a thing. Every time, like, people discussed the Staff of Ages, it would be like, oh, Manx orgasms in the distance, oh, Manx loves this hack, oh, Manx jerks this hack off, meh, 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 and it's like... Uh, I don't think I did them that many favors by praising it as much as I did. So, and... I mean, what can I say? I really love the hack. Yeah, I still think it's one of the best hacks out there, if it can only get fucking finished. Anyway, we're not playing Staff of Ages now. We're playing quite a different hack. My point is, I'm not gonna go out of my way to jerk this hack off in the same manner, even though I am starting to seriously love it. 
So let's see how if we can. Oh, is that a crit? I s oh no! I God, it's so difficult to. I, I haven't seen the crit animation yet. I think, but the, like the blinking staff always gets me. All right, here we go. Are you the pizza guy? No, we we killed that pizza guy with my with the other group. <laughs> Uh, oh wow, he actually doubles me. I think he might... Does he have Darting Blow? I know Sages have Darting Blow in the PME. Um, I think he might... No, he doesn't. He has Renewal, though. He's pr pragma both Pragmatic and Chivalry? That So he gets the bonus regardless. Um, I'll just send Jagger at him. Jagger will take him down. Pretty sure Jagger will doubles him, too. He has, like, 21 speed. It's crazy. Holy shit, you get so much experience in this hack. Power, skill, and speed. It seems like units just get experience regardless of their level. I'm not sure if it's true or not, but... The experience penalty just doesn't seem to be a thing here. Anyway, I think Chester is in range to play for him. Because I can probably just deal with him now. And I think Jagger still has a barrier on him. That's why he's not taking a, much, a lot of damage. Ah, oh, shit. Wait, I have reposition. Haha! -ha! I used the skill, guys. Are you guys proud of me? I'm good at Fire Emblem. Broo. Why doesn't he do a broo? I missed the broo. Anyway, just quickly look over, over, over the map to see if there's some, like no houses or shit that I haven't visited. No, I'm good. Whack, 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 whack. Let me finish smoking. <coughs> Oof. Oh, right, his name is Smokey. Right, I get it. Luck. What a good uh, level up right here. Best that. Yeah, boy. Wait. Wait. What? Wait. Would we have been able to, to visit the house? I don't know. Would we? Alright, kid. Fork over the cash. I've been trying to tell you this whole time. Nobody's in the school. What? Fuck. Now that I think about it, it's July. Good fucking damn it. Why did you hurt the smelly man? Scram, you little shit. <laughs> Looks like they managed to trick us, team. First time and the last time. Yeah, bro, no more fucking around. Let's head to the waterfront. Maybe we'll meet up with some of our friends. Chester needs to build an army. Why did I agree to this? Mistakes were made. Can you explain how you teleported? I don't feel like it. Stop being so fucking emo. Goth, note emo. There's a difference. Ugh, let's just head to the waterfront. We can take my boat when we get there. Alright. Cool. So that was a chapter. God, I love this hack. Like, I've completely fallen in love with this hack. This hack is so much fun to play. Oh, I hope you guys are enjoying it as much as I am. Give it a like and a comment and go join their Discord and tell them how amazing their hack is. Oh shit, I circled working the hack. I said I wouldn't. Ah, but it's so good. See you guys next time.